Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Jamie, and on this channel you can find all things luxury handbags, neutrals, and elevated style. You can also find me over on Instagram at Lux Petite, where I'm styling my brown and beige handbags. Now in today's video, I have the Ro Raffia bag unboxing, plus some summer luxury items that I picked up. So let's get right into it. with the handbag. I'm not gonna keep you guys from waiting on what this bag is. Now, I'm just gonna start with this bag was totally inspired from my last video and that was my summer bag top 10 list. And of course, I had to note the row in there. And this spring season, they introduced this handbag and I actually gave up looking for this bag and what do you know sometimes when you just are not even trying to look this bag just pops up i tried looking for this one and it was i thought i was just out of luck but let me show you guys i actually haven't seen it in person i just took it out of the box and i haven't took it out of the dust bag so here we go the estelle tote ah look at this one it's it's so cute i'm Loving the size. <gasps> Look at this. This is the cutest raffia toe. Like, talk about the perfect shoulder toe. I mean, I can't get over the size. I Like I said, I haven't seen this in person. This is, oh, in the quality of the raffia out here, this brown color, ooh, you guys know I love a good brown. And even like the detailing, look at this. This is from the row there. I ordered this directly from the Roe website and I think even my friend Layla Sophia, she's even said in her videos that you got to check out the row on their website because sometimes things pop up just when you think things are out of stock. So this one too, it's the Estelle in the color brown for y'all if you're looking and I would even check um, to see if you guys are interested. But this one was priced at $1,100, which I know it's raffia, but I will say that I'm glad I didn't pay over the retail price because I even saw a few of them that were over and I was like, no, I'm just going to stick with my Celine raffia tote. But this one is certainly, it's the cutest size. Show you guys. Look at that. Uh, so cute. Love that. Oh my gosh, I'm like loving this. This one was my favorite from the spring and summer 2024 collection. And definitely when they saw the brown one, I could not resist. If if I could find it, I was going to add this to my collection. But this was my, my favorite one um, out of the Raffia tote bags this year. I love it. I still think that Celine has an amazing selection. There's like so many different Celine raffia and wicker bags out there but this is definitely a welcome addition let me get my Celine summer bag so you can kind of see the combination I just love that this one is such a casual chic bag here we go aren't we loving this this to me is like a dressy type of version go to dinner take this with you and then this one is like day you know day to night loving this and I love that they're different leathers you got the the dark brown and this is more of a tan brown i'm kind of like just loving all the summer vibes right here so good let me know what you guys think of my newest row bag this is my beautiful summer toe i'm obsessed with this guys so good and yeah there's nothing there's no pockets it's just an open inside too and it does have the little leather pieces that you can tie but it's not a very secure because you just can tie the insides there you go okay okay so I wanted to just show you guys a couple of summer items that I picked up over the season so over on Instagram I actually revealed these were my latest sandals from Hermes and these are the chippery I want to say sandals these are perfection I'm loving this it's that natural brown color which is 
pretty perfect for my wardrobe. I did take a size 38, and so in the Oasis and the Orans, I am a size 38. I think that's the perfect size, and I love that now I have all three. Let me know if you guys would be interested in hearing a shoe comparison between my Orans, the Oasis, and these sandals. I could do like a comparison, and it's that was actually one of my first videos on my channel when I did my, my Oran comparison in-depth review, so it'd be interesting to do probably an, another comparison, but these ones are just, I feel like these are the perfect dad type of sandal for casual summer. To round out my shoe picks for summer, I actually picked up a pair of slingbacks. These are from Jimmy Choo. I really wanted a pair of white slingbacks that I could wear, you know, it could be day to night. I just really loved the elegant, the nice gathered leather here. I thought that was such an interesting, nice design detail. And of course, I love that it's in this off-white shade. It's like ivory, not like a stark white, but this is pretty much, I love a creamy off-white because I think that goes well with my skin tone. And then of course the heel, it's not like a very tall heel. This is very manageable and I just think this is like super chic. Love this. And I got these over at Nordstrom too and they're in a size 38 too. I'm typically a seven and a half or an eight and I thought the 38 were perfect. I have a quick little beauty pick and this shade is the pink lilac shade and this was an exclusive with Sephora. So here's the shade. I was just really obsessed with finding this. I was so excited to find it and I think you guys probably saw on Instagram I was looking for this particular shade. It's just like a nice gloss and I'm a sucker for the packaging. I don't know about you guys but I just thought this was such a pretty color. Super fun for summer. I love the Dior lip glosses. I think they're really nice moisturizing for the lips. So many fun colors. And then my last pick is a clothing item, and this one is from the brand Veronica Beard, and I'm kind of obsessed with this one because I just love a good blazer, and this is something that I can totally dress up or down, pair it with jeans. I thought, I love this color, it's called Latte. This, to me, it's so chic. I took a size medium. So then definitely had a little bit of room, not super tight, but I just love the color. I love the contrast with the buttons. Let's see here. And it looked really good on my petite frame. And again, I'm 5'2 in height, but I, I love her, this brand. There are two women that run this brand and I just, I love their pieces. So good. I kind of obsessed with like trying to keep adding more pieces from this particular brand. I also picked up this beautiful dress from Sandro. I'm loving all the details, and of course, it's in this beautiful beige shade. If you see up close, you can see the threads. They have a little bit of a metallic sheen to it. And I just thought this was the perfect dress, whether I wore it to work and with some like dressier heels or make it more casual, some sandals and a bucket bag. I will have some photos so y'all can see, but. I thought this was like the perfect summer dress. Okay guys, well that is it for my summer unboxings. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Let me know what was some of your favorite items from today. Put it in the comments below and be sure to like and subscribe. I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Take care.